Inching closer for the tightest U.S. Senate race in the country, and the nation is watching. Look at these numbers from a brand new NBC News Marist poll, which show a statistical dead heat between incumbent Pat Roberts and independent Greg Orman. Garrett Hake shows us the big names one of those candidates brought to the Metro today. Garrett? Yeah, Justin, we're just one week away from Election Day, and today Senator Roberts brought not one, but two former Republican presidential nominees here to Overland Park to try to make an argument he's been trying to make since the primary, that he's someone Kansans know and should trust. <laughs> Cheers and a sea of camera phones greeted Senator Pat Roberts and his biggest endorser yet, former presidential nominee Mitt Romney. It is essential that we elect Pat Roberts again to the U.S. Senate. Romney echoed what has become the Roberts campaign mantra, calling independent candidate Greg Orman a Democrat in disguise. A vote for Greg Orman is a vote for Barack Obama, and America, America should not make that mistake three times. For Roberts, today's event aimed to bring home wayward Republicans who turned away from the incumbent during his ugly primary fight. You know where I stand. Bob Dole and Mitt Romney know where I stand. They trust me, and they are asking you to trust me. That's why they're here today. In his remarks, mostly obscured by the crowd as he sat in a chair on stage, Senator Dole made another ask, this time of Romney. And so for all those reasons and for the fact that he's a friend of mine and that I want him to run again. In an exclusive interview, Romney said, not so fast. Are you thinking about it anymore? You know, I'm not running, not planning on running. I got nothing new on that, but I'm here today to support Pat Roberts because really the people of Kansas are going to make a decision that the whole nation is, uh, is waiting to understand, and that is are we going to have three times where people vote for Barack Obama or just two? And Roberts will be right back here in Overland Park again tomorrow, campaigning with a Republican of a different stripe, Tea Party darling Senator Rand Paul of Kentucky. With the polls locked in a statistical tie, Roberts needs every Republican vote he can get. Reporting live, Garrett Hake, 41 Action News. Thanks, Garrett. And candidate Greg Orman responded to today's meeting, saying no matter how many national politicians Senator Roberts brings to Kansas, Kansans know that Washington is broken and Senator Roberts is part of the problem. Roberts lives in Washington, rarely visits Kansas, and yet news reports say he's barely attended committee meetings. Orman made one campaign stop himself earlier today and will meet with volunteers in about 45 minutes.